The college campus and human body share many characteristics. They are both comprised of many individuals that form systems to aid in the overall function. The heart is the center of the body and the primary organ of the circulatory system, driving all activity in the body. The circulatory system acts as the transportation for the body. It's the roads and walkways that allow the transport of nutrients and cells. The pathways are called vessels and come in many shapes and sizes with different levels of traffic. While the circulatory system transports cells and nutrients, it doesn't tell them where to go. That's the job of another system. The nervous system acts as the messenger, directing traffic and purpose. The brain sends information throughout the body via nerves. These nerves hold packets of information to be interpreted by cells and tissues. Electricity drives the nervous system, sending information almost instantly. The immune system acts as the maintenance crew of the body. Keeping organs and tissues in good repair is a constant job. The immune system also protects the body from potentially dangerous entities. White blood cells, or leukocytes, are the heavy hitters of the body's defenses. The digestive system provides nutrients for the body by breaking down food. Healthy cells and systems need constant nourishment to grow. The body, therefore, creates a lot of waste material. The excretory system's job is to remove this waste, eliminating it from the body, maintaining health. <laughs>